Hello, I'm Roman and this is the winter special vlog on the Movavi channel. Today I'm going to talk about how to shoot photos and videos outside in winter without getting your camera damaged and still getting amazing results. Let's get started! Our vlog is coming from frozen Siberia. Winter here starts in November and, if we're lucky, ends in April. That's six months of below zero temperatures. This is plenty of time to capture an incredible number of beautiful shots. You may not know that such temperatures will have an adverse effect on most cameras. Instructions usually say that the acceptable operating temperature range is from zero to plus 35 Celsius or 95 Fahrenheit. But that doesn't mean that you should completely abandon the idea of shooting outside in the winter. Tip number one. The first thing you need to keep in mind while preparing for your shoot is that the battery runs out faster in cold weather. That's why I recommend keeping your batteries warm before shooting, in the inside pocket of your jacket or in front pocket of your jeans. Don't let them out too much, and you'll find this little trick can help you slightly increase battery life. I recommend pulling the batteries out of the camera when you get back indoors and letting them rest for an hour or two. Tip number two. If you get snowy weather, your shots will be amazing. Assuming the snow doesn't get into your lens, or worse, soak the whole camera. If you have an SLR camera without a lens hood, you can make one yourself from cardboard. It will protect the lens from snow. You can protect the camera itself using an umbrella. If you often shoot in snow or rain, you might need a special raincoat as well. Tip number 3. Don't let the snow get inside your camera when you change your lens. But even on a day without precipitation, try not to breathe on the camera when changing the lens, so the internal surfaces do not mist up. Tip number 4. To ensure that your camera lasts a long time, after shooting outside in winter, repeat these steps every time. Put the camera away in a trunk or bag or backpack, but not under your clothes. The most dangerous thing in that situation is sudden temperature drop. Condensation forms from it, and not just what we see on the outer lens or on the viewfinder, but also inside the body. When you go indoors with the camera, do not remove it from the bag immediately. Let it come up to the room temperature slowly, preferably for a couple of hours. After that, you can get it out and enjoy your footage. Tip number 5. This advice you had gotten from your mother long before you even got your first camera. Dress warmly. Experienced photographers and camera operators know that when you shoot in the cold, your fingers can freeze instantly. You will not be able to warm your fingers in your pockets. You need them to operate the camera. Wear warm gloves or mittens. And don't forget your hat. When you're dressed warmly, the weather won't limit you. You can shoot outside as much as you need. If you decide to film nature in winter, take a vacuum flask with hot drink. I hope with our advice you will be able to capture the beauty of winter. That's if of course you don't live on the California coast. If you do, we will welcome you to Siberia. Check out this tutorial and add explosions to your video. Subscribe to our channel, ding the bell below and keep your feet in a warm place. See you soon on the Movavi channel. And I'm getting out of here. <laughs>